I am back at the Disney outlet in Cypress, Texas. This will be my last trip here as I'm about to move, but let's see what they got. Not many of these left in the world, but let's see what this one has today. They have these Buzz Lightyear sets, which actually have some really cool figurines in here. And the entire thing with the discount is $7 after all this. That's kind of crazy. Plus I get an extra 10% off because of my Disney Visa. Obi-Wan Kenobi for, I believe with the discount, it's $15. They have the Disneyland shirt. Unfortunately, they never really have like large sizes here, but if you're smaller, they have some great deals. Oh, they have Oswald ears. So I can get the Oswald ears for $15, yeah. Oh, they have the entire Oswald collection. I did find a 2XL Oswald shirt, and this one is going to be around $14. Y'all, these were $65 originally. They are down then to $4 plus 25% off which means they are $3, and they did have a 2XL for these. That's awesome. This is crazy. Y'all, I found a 3XL Oswald shirt. Look at that. I can't believe it. A little dry erase countdown stand. I like this Oswald, but I don't think I'm getting it. I've got to be somewhat thoughtful. So I love this. This is currently $37 plus 25% off, so you do the math. But, and it does, they do have a 2XL. Here's the challenge. When am I gonna be able to wear something that's that hot? So if you come in, all, most of your clearance stuff is on the right and the other stuff is gonna be on the left. This is, they do have a lot of the normal price stuff too. They do have lounge flies. This is 50 plus 25% off. That's a great piece right there. Again, I have nowhere, oh, it's not, thick okay it's like a rain jacket oh wow 40 plus 25 percent off so that would be th they have the disney map shirt it's only 15 dollars plus 25 percent off for my dooney and burke fans they do have the 50th moana it's like a disney pets thing going on here it is nine dollars now ten dollars so it's 750 any loki fans $25 plus 25% off. Y'all, they have the train. Oh, it's still $300 though, plus 25% off, but still no train for me. This is the first time I've seen, the, the, this is the first piece of uh, X-Men merchandise I've seen. Captain America, Thor, Spider-Man. Apparently there's also a giant Titanic clock. I didn't even know Disney owned the Titanic. They have the Pooh Munchling bag the poop munchling bag is 25 plus 25 percent off okay this is only like this is 15 dollars after discounts that's cool a stitch panty pack oh yeah it is oh i might have to get this one classic bag there and star wars bag so this castle collection is normally 150 now it's 25 plus 25 percent off Oh, it's Merida's castle. Oh, I did not know that. I'm sorry. Yo, no way. Look, look what I found. Oh my gosh, for $3. Peter Pan make-believe set with all that stuff in it. That's awesome. Look at the Bambi one. See, adult fashion for all of you haters. See, this would be cool. I want this as a t-shirt for men. Chubby ears, but I think these are not on sale. They have the Pinocchio bag, but again, it is not on sale. They have Thor for $7.50. Now they have this for only $30. Well, I did some damage. Let's go through it when I get home. So yeah, I went a little overboard on my uh, Disney outlet clearance uh, shopping. I did not mean to, but let's dive into it because they were having a massive sale and uh, Starting off with this one here. I'm not going to open it, but this is the Star Wars toy box. This was normally $40. Well, I don't know what it normally was. It was on clearance for $40. Another 25% off that, making it $30. And then using my Disney Visa. By the way, shout out to Tinker Corey for letting me know that you could get a debit Disney Visa. Did not know that. And I saved an extra 10% and I get all the perks of being a Disney Visa card holder. So anyway... Um, this ended up being like $27 plus tax after all of that. 
This is a gift for a friend. You guys gotta stay tuned till the end for the big piece that I got, it's so cool. So I got several of these. This is from um, Treasure Planet, and I've got some friends that are really big Treasure Planet fans. These are normal, I don't know what, again, I don't know what they normally are, but uh, they were on sale for $4, uh, clearance for $4. This is the 20th anniversary one. For $4, 25% off that, and I think they ended up being $2.70 plus tax. So I got several of these. So uh, if you're one of my friends that really likes Treasure Planet and I know it, you're probably getting one of these. And yeah. This is the Oswald mug. This was on clearance for $13 plus 25% off plus 10% off of that. So this is the Oswald mug. That's quite a bit of the Oswald collection from the 100th anniversary stuff. So I did pick up quite a bit of that. You'll see more Oswald coming up. I got some Jungle Cruise ears. I also think these make great tiki ears. So they have a Winnie the Pooh version of this, but I couldn't. they didn't have it there. So I got the Oh Tigger Where Are Your Manners one. And there you can see it's a little Tigger cake tray. This was on clearance for $10 plus 25% off makes it $7.50 plus another 10% off would make it $6.75. Like, how do you turn down Tigger for $6.75? Madame Medusa, Thor, Love and Thunder. This was, look at all these, even if you don't like the movie, these are some great pieces uh, of Thor. And this was on sale for clearance for $10. Again, plus 20% off. So $6.75 for this set. Entire set. This Black Panther shirt was uh, on sale for $4. And then after discounts, again, $2 and something. So, and it was in 2XL. Uh, yes, I'm picking it up. Look, it's for the Waldo collection. I didn't even notice the back when I bought it. Uh, this is fantastic. So I think I ended up paying like $13 or whatever for that. But look at it. This is amazing. So Oswald Hill ears there, button up, short sleeve, 2XL, 3XL, y'all, look at the back. I think it was um, on clearance for $27 and then, you know, the other discounts. That's so cool. I have like three Oswald shirts now. That's amazing. The Emperor is a gift for a friend. Look at this. I can't remember. I think this was $10. I'm pretty sure I got this giant thing. I don't know. Do I leave it in the box? What do you guys think? Should I leave this in the box or is this one I take out of the box? Speaking of Dr. Strange, got this set, another one that was after everything was like $6 and something. Did I love the movie? I liked the movie, I didn't love the movie, but I do think there's several characters here that just on their own, you know, that kind of, that is valuable. I did not see this movie, but I cannot, it's like $6, I, I had to do it. I got the entire Buzz Lightyear set. Honestly, I feel like just the Zerg in here is worth what I paid for this, which I, is pretty awesome. And it actually like lays out to make it into, I gotta watch this movie, but it lays out to do this entire thing here. I actually got pants. I've never, I don't think I've ever gotten pants on clearance, but they're Star Wars pants. I don't, will I ever wear them? I don't know, but they were, you know, actually, I think these are 2XL or 3XL. So these were 3X and Star Wars right there. But then the side is where you can, down here is where you actually get the Star Wars stuff at. So it's not like blatant, it's on the bottom here. Now, I thought this was really a good find. If you guys remember, these were selling for like $40, $30, whatever it was. I got three of them, <laughs> yeah, because they make a little Mickey in your hand if you get it to do right. I got three of them and they were $8, so these were like five fifty. dollars so I bought three. Yeah, uh-huh, kitchen sink, bath two bathroom sinks, yes please. I went live and somebody taught me into buying the 90s, or early 90s stitch hat because I had already bought the bag that went with it. This was $5 for the beach towel, uh, yes. 
I wanted Tiana. I wish if they had Tiana, I would have probably bought like three of them. But this is Moana. She's great. I got the Aswan lamp. <laughs> okay, I'm so happy with this. So this was on sale, discounted, I think. So $30 plus discount, whatever. I don't know what it ended up being. Uh, like 25-ish, maybe, I don't know. And that, so I spent like $260 on all of this. Did you guys see anything I should have gotten? And I will be checking out some more character warehouses and Disney outlets. So make sure to follow along because I am moving in two weeks.